Right, 100% Chelsea. Martin, what did you think about today's parades? What did you think about the players on the bus, the whole atmosphere? The atmosphere is very good, but not as good as I've seen in previous years. Yeah. I think they didn't stay long enough in uh, actually in certain positions because yeah. last year, it's, uh, on years previous, it certainly went on longer. Yeah, it, it appeared did. to be going on longer. Yeah. Um, this year, it just seemed to be they wanted to get it over and done with as quick as possible. Yeah. Um, but it, they, they don't seem to um, make arrangements for the fans to actually be, to see everything. It's good to have it in a park, but you need to be at a different level so yeah. you people can see. Because yeah. there's lots of young families and kids here, yeah. and it's very difficult to see. So I think they could do something maybe in the future with, the, you know, perhaps the kids, give them somewhere to stand yeah. so they can see over the people. Um, that would make a lot of difference. Yeah, that's true. I mean, yeah, the, the whole thing... It's a family occasion. You know, lots of people don't come to the matches because it's so expensive and this is the only chance they get to see their heroes on the bus. Yeah, it's true. So it's, it's true. I think it's very good that, you know, that you should try and make it so everyone can see what, you know, um, the bus, the trophy, the people speaking and it wasn't the same as in previous years. Brilliant. Well, um... It was a lot shorter than the Champions League one, that's for sure. I remember yeah. the Champions League one. Um, itself, I mean, when the players were on the bus and they were it talking... I, 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 well, one message I want to talk about is Peter Cech. Do you think he's going? I do, and I think he deserves to go somewhere where he's going to play regular football. Yeah. Uh, it'll be his decision and probably the club's decision. Yeah. Um, I, as a fan, don't particularly would like, I'd like him to stay, but being number two, it's probably not... I couldn't do it. Yeah. If I was in the same boat, I couldn't do it. Yeah. So I have every sympathy with him. I'd go to another club where he's going to play regular football. Even if it's in the Premiership with Man United or Arsenal, I don't care as long as he's playing football. He's done a good service to Chelsea and he should, you know, get the, for the last two or three years some nice contracts, you know, and, yeah. and enjoy his football. And I hope he does. You know, good Definitely. luck to him. Definitely. And next year, Champions again? I think we've got a chance. I think we need one or two players in certain positions. Um, I'd like to see another world-class striker because I don't think we can rely on Diego Costa on a regular basis. Seems to have a lot of injuries. Um, he's got a funny temperament as well. And if he gets sent off and we lose him for three or four games a season, it will make a difference to us. Um, we've got many people who can score goals all over different positions but we need a world class another Didier drop bar someone that can hold the ball up and lay it off to other people and we haven't had that for a very long time all right well get a new drop bar guys 100% Chelsea guys the parade's finished how was that that was pretty amazing wasn't it? it was yeah, absolute carnage absolutely